The Low Country has so many wonderful festivals this time of the year. We got your seafood festivals and your wine festivals and yeah. all those fancy, you know, high-end stuff. And then we got Wing Fest. That's the festival. Wing Fest is going on uh, on the 18th. That's mm -hmm. the day after St. Patrick's Day. You can take that silly thing off now. No, Joe I'm Kane, keeping it on. This Center. is what I'm known okay. for. Wing right. Fest is the festival. It is indeed the festival. In fact, there is a story behind <laughs> your wing hat there. Tell it's actually that. from uh, the Anchor Bar in Buffalo, which is the home of the chicken wings. So every three years we get a new one, and uh, this is the fourth one, I think. How about it? They actually send you one and, and yeah. say, yeah, sure. Yeah, I walk around all day with it. I take about <laughs> 70 ah. pictures with people I don't know. It's just take a picture with a fool with a wing on his head. All right. As I mentioned, March 18th, the day after St. Patrick's Day, it's Saturday, uh, 11 to 5 at Low Country Celebration Park. Yes. You had it there for the first time mm -hmm. last year, and it just exploded. It, it was huge. It was the 25th annual. We, yeah. like, we jokingly say it took us 27 years to do the 25th, but it was massive. So many people, and uh, it's just a great spot. A lot of parking, and people can walk there. Okay, obviously there are wings, mm -hmm. and lots of wings. What else will folks get at Wing Fest? We've got some great bands this year. Yeah. Well, two of the same bands last year. Savannah's premier ba uh, party band, The True Gentleman, and then from Ohio, Ohio's premier band, The Naked Karate Girls. They wear clothes, they're guys, they're fun. A lot of that 80s the stuff, naked they karate dress girls. up. All right. Oh yeah, they are a trip. Plus there's Kids Zone for the kids. And then and there's other foods there besides chicken wings. I was going to say, what else can yeah. you eat? If, uh, for folks who don't like chicken wings, mm -hmm. there may be a couple of you. What? Yeah, uh, Melly Mel's out there, and he does a, like chicken fingers, yeah. uh, hot dogs, things like that. So he, uh, uh, so there's something not just chicken wings there. And plus adult beverages, kids' yeah. beverages, uh, ice cream. It's all something for everybody this there. This is fantastic. And, of course, it all benefits the Island Rec Center, which is uh, makes you the busiest guy in town this time yeah. of year. We're a nonprofit and goes to our scholarship fund. We'd like to say that no child is denied recreation. There we go. And and and. That's getting ready to get really busy as we get into the later spring. Mm -hmm. Pool's open already. Yeah, actually, as, uh, the pool yeah. is, the, is the dome is coming down this week. Okay, all right. So, uh, so then there'll be an outside pool again. The outside pool <laughs> and and with spring break coming yep. and all of that happening. Uh, that, that and then soccer starting up for us. Uh, basketball yeah. just ended. So there's always something going on at the rec center. Is this your biggest? Fest. I mean, yeah. you guys have a number of different fests, mm -hmm. you know, including yeah. snowballs and all that. Snow stuff. day, which well, was snow day last. Snow month. day was yeah. huge. Was by it? The way. Oh my gosh! The line for the snow field was everywhere. Yeah. Um, and uh, it was great. And then the oyster festival back in November is another big one for us. Sure. But Wing Fest is the granddaddy. Yeah, yeah. Have you found a different? Have you found your wing? Preferences have changed at all? Do you like a, a different kind of wing it's, now than you it, it, used it's to? It's funny. I'm originally from Rochester, an hour from Buffalo, so I okay. know chickens. I'm maybe lucky to get one wing that day because we, there's the judging part of it, and, and I'm running wings to the judges. And there's a people's choice, by the way, so you can vote also. Okay. Um, but I, I want really the napkins session. I want to sell <laughs> napkins at Wing Fest. If you guys yeah. sold napkins, you'd make ten times the money. <laughs> we actually supply the uh, the napkins to the restaurants, actually. Yeah. So, I'm, I'm, so they're and, doing and, it for yeah. Yeah, so and then we actually free. also supply the chicken wings. So we buy the wings, and then we boom get to the. To so the them up. the good news from all of that, and the good news in the, in the world of fundraising and all of that is. You're going to be able to make some more money for mm -hmm. Island Rec Center this year because the price of chicken wings is down. Well, chicken price wing is way down from last year, so hopefully we can. It won't be as much as last year. Yeah. So yeah. we're figuring that out right now. And yet we're still going to have gazillions of wings, right? Gazillion, there gazillion, will not be a trillion wings. Yes. You won't run out. Will you? Is no, there any chance? We've never run out. You've never, never run, run out. out. All right. So you can even come later on in the day, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. is the time frame. Um, again, March 18th. That's the day after St. Patrick's Day. And Bob day. Stevens yes. is. Going going to be there. Oh. Two tickets. Wow. <laughs> Whoo, these are babies are gold. All right. I'm going to guard them with my life. <laughs> Should. <laughs> Joe, great to talk to Thank you. Thank you. Two words, be there. Be there. Absolutely. <laughs> Island Rec Center having the uh, a Wing Fest coming up March 18th at Low Country Celebration Park. And as he just said, be there. We'll be back with more of the WHHI Daily News right after this.